Hi. Hi, hi. Hi, Joe. Mm, do you hear me? Oh. Mm, I'm eating at the moment. I hope that's okay for you. <laughs> mm, such a stressful day, or just life in general. Mm. Can you hear me? Are you there? Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Hi. Hi.
<sighs> Hi. What's up? What's up, everyone? <laughs> hmm.
Hi. <laughs> Hi, Ju. How's it going? Can you hear me? <lacht> Schön, dass es geklappt hat. Was genau meinst du? <lacht> Mir geht's. Ich fühle mich so, als hätte ich auch ein Nap nötig. So geht es mir. Aber sonst eigentlich ganz gut. Uh, Leben ist gerade ein bisschen viel. Ich habe viel um die Ohren. Um, ja, also ich weiß auch irgendwie gar nicht so richtig. Ich bin so noch gar nicht so richtig angekommen hier im Livestream, muss ich sagen. Ha. Aber mir geht's gut. Wie geht's dir so? Und noch eine andere Frage, wenn es nichts so persönlich ist. Wie waren deine Dates? Oh ja, das ist tatsächlich schön, mal wieder hier zu sein. <lacht> Freue mich zu hören, dass es so gut funktioniert mit deinem Date. Ich hoffe, der Film war auch gut. <lacht> ich war übrigens in Barbie, falls dich das interessiert. <lacht> Fand ich ganz angenehm. Also als Komödie auf jeden Fall sehr angenehm. Sehr in, ähm, innovativ. Kannte ich so noch nicht. Also diese Art von Komödie. Man geht mit einer ganz anderen Idee, Idee in so einen Barbie-Film rein. <lacht> Ähm, um. <lacht> oh nein. Oh nein. Ja, ich verstehe, wenn es so spüle ist. Ich muss sagen, ich habe auch so zu kämpfen und ich bin nicht in einer Gärtnerei. Aber im Café, oh, im Café ist es schon sehr... <lacht> Vor allem, wenn so viele Kunden kommen, kann ich es gar nicht... Äh, was ist gerade so bei mir? Warum bin ich so busy? Äh, ich nehme gerade ein paar Überstunden. Ähm, ja, habe sonst nicht so wirklich Zeit für mich. Aber ich möchte mir jetzt wieder die Zeit nehmen, weil ich jetzt auch einfach die Woche frei habe, quasi. Ähm, also auch wenn es dich nicht interessiert, aber ich habe jetzt äh, vor, ein Longboard-Video zu machen. 
Äh, und sonst, ja. Ja. Sonst passiert nicht so viel bei mir. Also, ich merke einfach, dass ich äh, sehr viel äh, Zeit quasi habe, um Bücher zu lesen und zu malen. Malen geht gerade ein bisschen nach hinten los, also das funktioniert nicht so gut. Aber immerhin. <lacht> und im Café so richtig viel los. <lacht> so wirklich, wirklich viel. Ja, aber Barbie ist auf jeden Fall ein guter Film, den man auch zu Hause gucken kann. Ja. <lacht> mm. Das passiert gerade in meinem Leben. Ja, ich habe auch ein echt neues Board. Ähm, warte mal, vielleicht kann ich dir mal zeigen, wie es aussieht. Ah, ich zeig's dir später mal. Und sonst zeige ich es dir im, sch im schlimmsten Fall. Außer du möchtest jetzt kurz, dass ich es dir zeige. Aber das ist auch, also einerseits, also finde ich es halt voll schön beim Longboarden, dass man sich auf das Board freuen kann. Da, wenn man sich so eine coole Marke so ausgesucht hat, dann hat man auch so ein Stück, Stück Kunst so vor sich. Das ist auch irgendwie was Tolles. Ja, bei den Malen geht es nach hinten los, weil ich eigentlich mehr Lust hätte, Zeit aufzufinden. so, Aber da es einfach gerade so zu viel ist, ähm, sehe ich mich einfach momentan viel öfter, mein Buch in die Hand zu nehmen, weil das so viel weniger Energie äh, wegnimmt. Obwohl ich gerne zeichnen mag. Aber das ist so, das ist zeitintensiv, das ist energieziehend und ja, also <lacht> dann hat man im Endeffekt auch ich habe keine Ahnung, für mich das Buch ist so ein bisschen wie Netflix gucken, weil es einfach so einfach funktioniert. Und wenn es dann darum geht, halt zu zeichnen, da muss man aktiv dran arbeiten. Also ich mache es natürlich gerne, aber ja. Okay, äh, aber ich zeig dir gerne, ich zeig dir gerne mein Board. Gib mir eine Sekunde. Siehst du das? Voll schön, oder? Ich finde... Ja, ich weiß auch nicht. Ich habe also... freue mich einfach immer wieder, einfach so ein Nummer zu haben, weil es quasi... <lacht> das könnte man auch einfach in die Vitrine stellen, so weißt du? Deswegen, also andererseits natürlich ein bisschen traurig, dass man das so ein bisschen abfährt. Ein bisschen mehr als nur ein bisschen. Aber... So für den Moment, so für einen halben Monat bis Monat bis zwei Monate vielleicht, ist das schon ein Augenschmaus. <lacht> ja. Ja, aber ich meine, solange du Zeit findest und ich finde, vor allem auch, wenn man jemanden datet, da hat man auch nicht so viel Zeit und genießt einfach die Zeit anders. Also habe ich natürlich auch gerade ein bisschen. Deshalb ist auch einer der Gründe, warum ich nicht so viel Zeit habe. Äh, ja. Wie war denn jetzt eigentlich das Buch, was du gelesen hast? Also es war schon... Ich fand, das war so ein bisschen Meta, also einfach über das Interesse an Bücher lesen. Also ich kann mir nichts darunter vorstellen, außer dass jemand quasi so Bücher komplementiert. Also komplementiert? Das ist kein deutsches Wort. Einfach Komplimente macht so. Und das Buch, was ich gelesen habe, war auch einfach für den Arsch. Ha. Aber ich finde es halt einerseits, ach ja, was ich noch sagen wollte, ist, 
ich habe letztens durch das Longboarding-Video äh, mein meine Kamera wieder in die Hand genommen und merke einfach so, wie mir das ein bisschen fehlt. Vor allem beim Reisen hatte ich das gehabt, dass ich immer wieder was Neues entdeckt habe und ich wollte das einfach irgendwie so, ich wollte das halt verewigen. Und jetzt habe ich das gerade nicht so sehr, weil ich so einen Alltag habe. Ähm, und die Stadt Köln ist halt schön, ja. Äh, müsste wahrscheinlich noch mir ein bisschen Zeit nehmen, um die so ein bisschen zu erkunden. Aber wiederum denke ich mir dann, ich habe hier mein ganzes Leben lang gelebt in Deutschland. Und ein, also wenn es halt nicht äh, irgendwo im Süden in Bayern ist oder so oder im Osten vielleicht, dann sind für mich Dinge hier einfach auch gar nicht so es wertvoll so zu verewigen. Ich weiß nicht, ob du das kennst, weil das ist halt einfach so normal, jeden Tag, was man sieht. Und wiederum gibt es wahrscheinlich andere Leute in Amerika und die denken sich so, wow, Deutschland, so toll. <lacht> weißt du, was ich meine? Naja. Ja, genau. Ich meinte, the cat who saved books. <lacht> Interessanter Name eigentlich. <lacht> Hast du eigentlich vor, bei diesem Livestream auch was zu machen? Oder wolltest du nochmal kurz durchschalten und Hallo sagen? Was macht ihr eigentlich beiden, also wenn ihr Zeit unternimmt, außer halt <lacht> euch äh, gegenseitig natürlich irgendwie Zeit zu nehmen und ähm, <lacht> eure Gegenwart zu genießen? Also gibt es irgendwelche Dinge, wo ihr da so ein paar Interessen findet? <lacht> also ich muss sagen, <lacht> bei mir auch sehr langweilig äh, oder gemütlich, wie man das auch immer äh, formulieren möchte. Ich mache auch nicht so viel bei meinem Date. Wir liegen auch nur im Bett rum und gucken Netflix. Uh, du kannst mir gerne mal sagen, welche Orte in Deutschland toll sind. Hi, Eva. Hi. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. So, Eva, now that you are here, I will continue in English because I don't want you to listen to my German voice. That would... That would um, hinder our togetherness because I don't like your German pronunciation either. <laughs> Why can't you stay? What's more important than me? <laughs> huh? Absolutely, yes, nothing. <laughs> okay, just say hi. I will take it personal. Okay, makes sense. Go help your grandma and go go to the lake. <laughs> Do 
To be honest, always feels nice to have some people in here, this live stream, although we are in the midst of uh, summer. Love you too. <laughs> nice to have you here. So the book is basically about a boy who lost his grandfather. He lived with him. And as he mourn, a cat appears who talks and is so funny and sassy. They do have certain, certain challenges. Oh. Oh, okay. <clears throat> hello everyone who's still joining <laughs> hello hello i am live streaming as you see <clears throat> they all have a certain challenge as well as writing books and there's still lots of wisdom and point of views about reading and books taking your time to read it reread what books mean to certain people hmm <laughs> more like a child book kind of how did you stumble upon this this book recommend um, this book? <laughs> Bye, Eva. Enjoy your day. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. <laughs> <coughs> Otherwise, you're not a real fan. <laughs> okay. Okay. Whoopsie daisy. Swish. Um, what the heck? Okay. And there you go. We have a screen. We have a painting screen. As it should be. Oh yeah, I ch changed my background because Eva and I, we experimented and as you see, there is more con more texture in the background. So you can actually see what I'm drawing. This is quality of life we all were waiting for. Now the stream actually makes sense to watch. Cool. Um, what am I? What I'm doing with my date? So we actually really go out a ton. We booked a candlelight concert. Candlelight concert. What's this magical, whimsical thing that you do that I've never heard of? Is it a good dating idea? <laughs> City trips always great. Summer party on my work and at the Yamarkt, Hamburger Dome. Wow, why are you so creative and I am not? <laughs> uh, okay, you're just in bed. That's fair, that's fair.
Hello Lika, how are you? What's up? Lika, how was the rest of the weekend? Yes, I am productive. To be honest, I am all the spare hours in my day I have left, I spent on doing live streams. That's how dedicated I am. I'm also so tired. Holy damn. Mm. <laughs> yeah, the weekend was rough. But it was fun, yeah. Is there anything else that I've missed on the weekend? Um, just to let you know, Ju, uh, Lika and I and a lot of other longboarders, we've been to a weekend of fun and skate. <laughs> so it was in the Netherlands in Rotterdam. That was, that's what happened. And maybe you still know Lika from my old videos. <laughs> um, she was like, I was visiting Rotterdam and we made a small photo shoot. <laughs> just for reference here so you know what I we were talking about but yeah mm. Sarland thanks for giving me all the good dating ideas I can definitely <laughs> make this a future idea <laughs> thanks thanks <laughs> If someone would ask me um, why do I come up with great ideas, I will reference you. Don't worry. <laughs> you seem to be... You seem to know what you want. No, Lika, that's not what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to be proactively productive with me. That's what they're supposed to be here. <laughs> okay, text me a dating idea, Liz. I, I, will, I will take it. Thank you. <laughs> oh, benefits of live streaming. Getting dating ideas. And all I do is have to draw some sketchy lines <laughs> of course Lika you're famous but Jew Lika changed <laughs> Lika doesn't look like she was on the video she's a whole different person no she's still the same person amazing as before it's just the looks that changed. <laughs> you didn't miss out on else, I think. After the event, most people left. We skated a bit more and I had food, and that was about it. <laughs> no, you did not change. Sorry. <laughs> I seriously wonder if it, if one day when I do my live streams, there will actually be people here that use these live streams to encourage themselves to um, use utilize that time for working with me, <laughs> or if just these streams will supposed to be just for like filling up some spare time to chat with me. Both are fine. <laughs> Mm. How was the rest of my weekend? It was soulless. We've been in the Flixbus and we just 
trudge. No, like we were like, oh, I was so tired. The everyone in the bus was smelling and snoring, and my friend and I who like sat next to each other, we were like speaking <laughs> as like silently as possible, and yet it felt a bit like. I don't want to complain. It was okay. <laughs> it was just like, in total, I, I wrote eleven hours that day, so I was done. I was done. <laughs> this is the unpractical way of facetiming. <laughs> um, let's preface it here. At least these live streams gives you give you more or us more opportunities to stay in contact as one of us always fails to reply and when we reply it takes months. <laughs> We're bad friends. <laughs> Why are we like that? The weather's weird, so I understand if you're tired. I'm just here to... to socialize. My friends are on the internet. If you haven't noticed. The Candlelight Concert. They play music from Hans Zimmer's In the Dark with tones and tons of candles in Hamburg. Oh, that's cute. Wait, I do not need to write this down. You're sending me a dating idea list. <laughs> yeah, Flexbus rides are not the vibe. Like, I would not even ride Flexbus anymore because in Germany we have a Deutschland ticket now, which um, capacitates us to to ride throughout the entirety of Germany um, for like 50 euros a month. Uh, but <laughs> long and behold, I sometimes come to you to the Netherlands and we are not the same country. <laughs> so I have to pay money, more money to ride, especially for Flixbus. <sighs> Being an international person is so tiresome. <laughs> yeah, I know. I have I have difficulties um the universe can't handle. There's no more <laughs> Okay, I I shut up. <laughs> Mind-blowing news, I know. <laughs> I talk so much, I, I actually forgot what I want to draw. I know I'm drawing circles all the time here. And that's what I'm supposed to do. That's how head looks, heads look, kind of. But I forgot how I want to pose my head. <laughs> what? Oh yeah. No? Oh yeah. Are you both lying in bed? Is that what my live stream has turned into? People watching from, from the comfort of their bed. And is this a compliment to me? Or does it more sound like I am someone um, <laughs> who you use, like content that you use in order to um, fall asleep? <laughs> 
the process of your painting at first, you sort of make lines and circles, right? Yeah, exactly. And then I draw the eyes. Um, or, yeah, the nose, the mouth. And it looks like a pier. Mine looks like a pier too, so <laughs> we're on the same boat. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I can definitely show you some paintings. Um, wait, this was my first one, by the way. Maybe you still remember this one. I don't even draw like this anymore. It was... It was my... <laughs> but yeah, okay, this was like my real hat that I drew. Wait, you, I don't think you can see it, because I had this problem before. But it looks kind of like this. Yeah, okay, next one. Um, so, what I'm doing at the moment is, um, this was when I tried to draw a good head, like a really great head. Why is it not working? Hello, why aren't you working? Oh yeah, I don't know why. Okay, details, <laughs> you see? <laughs> Yeah, and when I'm trying to draw poses, that's what my drawings now look like. Um, just as a reference, this is this should be the pose left and right. <laughs> yeah, are you proud of me? Because I am proud of me. <laughs> Thanks. It's a pleasure. <laughs> Thank you. You know, one of my friends told me, uh, one of my friends told me that it's now since I have become a barista, um, I, and like in between like getting customers in and like giving their, their latte, uh, I basically don't do shit, so I fill up the time drawing, but don't let my boss know. <laughs> and my friend told me, you are basically being paid for paint, uh, paid for being an artist. You're an artist. He's like, yeah, I probably make more money than any artist that tries to become an expert. <laughs> I feel like everyone who wants to, uh, become an artist should become a uh, barista. That's... I'm telling you, that's the new way of becoming uh, an, an overpaid barista, uh, painter, sorry. <laughs> but yeah, the specific style is inspired by my, at least for now, inspiration. Um, and it's probably, you know her, you can just find her on Instagram. Um, that's her name, I typed it on the chat. The reason I chose her is, first of all, she's amazing. Her personality, 10 out of 10. Um, she reminds me a lot of me. Probably I'm just narcissistic. <laughs> uh, scrap it. Second of all, it's just cute what she's drawing. Uh, she draws little anime um, girls. Okay, not everything sounds wrong. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, it's cartoon style female characters, okay? Um, but that's another reason. Third reason is that she has a Patreon where she's like teaching people um, how to draw. And she gave a step by step lesson or like lessons uh, how you can become better. <laughs> I'm not naughty. Maybe I am naughty. <sighs> but yeah, become a barista and then just <laughs> just do like use your time up to enjoy yourself and your hobbies.
<laughs> that's the that's the spirit of of drawing. Ooh. Oh, are you writing a lot? I mean, if you want to write, becoming a barista is such a good way. It's just like, use a low intensity job. Um, I'm not sure about like, as you are a florist, uh, could very well be also possible. I'm not sure. Maybe your boss does not indulge um, in <laughs> you becoming a writer, but it's a possibility. Like another um, idea I once had was I wanted to learn languages. So I came up with, um, I know it's, it's very high intensity um, cardio. So you need to like cycling around um, whether it's sunny or raining, but uh, like the, the bicycle um, delivery um, people yeah, it's Lois VB. Um, you can basically like deliver food and listen to podcast or uh, or like listen to any language you want to learn, such as Norwegian, no, Norwegian for you too, or English or French or Spanish. And that's a simple way of like learning languages as well, because you basically work while listening to a language. So I always consider like uh, jobs that you can do in which you use up more time and still earn money. <laughs> Highly efficient. Yeah, it's such a good way of multitasking. I love those jobs. <laughs> Everyone hates them. <laughs> Okay, I don't think everyone hates being barista, but yep. What should I admit? I am naughty. You're right. <laughs> At least I admit it. <laughs> what about you? Why are you not admitting it? Let's let's all pretend not pretend, like let's all admit that we are just all naughty. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> Good, okay, you got me. This face looks better. I think so, <laughs> at least. <sighs> <laughs> You're learning from mistakes. I am an entire. I I. Mistakes are what I know. I'm known for. And I embrace it. No. Let's go back. Yep. Oh god. I can't fit the the eyes in. Why is painting so hard? So now that you both have stalked my my one and only <laughs> page that allows me to be a naughty naughty bitch, <laughs> what do you think of her and her art?
Oh, Lieke. Lieke. I know that you want to join my my Discord. There's a bunch of people in. I am in there. Ju is in there. And future you wants to be in there as well. We talk about art. We talk about books. We talk about skating. About everything. Maybe writing in the future. I can make another um, channel. Do you want to be in there? Just probably things that you want to uh, enjoy in, the, in there. I'm telling you, it's the one and only place you should be on the internet because it's my place. <laughs> oh, convinced? Oh yeah, um, I leave the link here. Oh, what do you mean? What do you mean you don't use Discord? Well, that's your chance to use Discord now. <laughs> Why didn't it work? Didn't it work? No. <laughs> it's not an ad. I'm not earning money. <laughs> Who is sponsored? I'm sponsoring myself. Yeah, I love our style as well. Oh, you're writing poetry. Lovely. Yeah, you can definitely share your writing. Um, I want to actually make my Discord channel a channel for creatives. So don't think that you are not part of my cult. <laughs> um, if, future, if the future allows, I will definitely also, because you once were interested in it, and like filmmaking and like photo, like taking pictures. So leaker, another reason to be in my, on my Discord channel. <laughs> um, yeah, so on another Discord channel, I did find uh, a bot that was Oh, and also people that um, for like doing writing challenges. Um, so many things we can do. Why did my link not work? Oh, hidden. Use copy button. But it didn't work. Oh, why it doesn't work? Oh my God. I kind of think that my invite link is bugged <laughs> maybe you should just tell me whether you actually want to be on the server <laughs> i'm just assuming things here what shut up hidden wait do you even see the link Am I wrong? I'm always wrong. We just, <laughs> we just figured it. Oh, I actually sent the link. I am stupid. I did. I can, f I saw it now. But it says my logging data is incorrect. That's a your problem. But you can make it work. I believe in you. <laughs> Shit. Hey, okay. To be frank, if you are on Instagram, you see more ads than I would ever like put on my in my chat. So I am 
I'm a lesser version of Instagram, of any ad that you see on the internet. I'm a humble ad. <laughs> okay, I'm done, right? Done sketching phases. Let's go to the poses. And you know what's the best shit about being, about um, being the, being my own ad? You don't even have to feel like you're being taken advantage of. There's nothing to gain of me, nothing. I follow a fitness YouTuber and she starts doing some coaching and got invited for free. So I'm going to challenge myself for the next six weeks. Oh, great. What's her or his name? <laughs> Fair. Okay, you won. You won. I admit defeat. I am... I'm a naughty... Uh, loser I lost what more to say <laughs> Great. <laughs> we are all naughty losers. So do do you want me? Do you actually care if I do? Oh wait, we have a. I mean, you. So basically, the creative hangout channel is supposed to be for art and writing and creative work. So, in essence, I have a channel already in which we, with that we can use. Uh, for inspiring each other to write as well. Alias Bertrand's. I'm going to check it out. Yes, please, do so. <laughs> and if ever this channel 
or more like this yeah like this channel on this chord becomes too full i separate them in art and writing <laughs> who cares hello everyone it seems like there's more people in here this is a productivity channel So what that means is no entertainment, just work. Oh, I mean, as opposed to watching me draw is probably entertaining already, but. Huh. What does that mean? Mm. <laughs> does it really matter if it's made for men or for women? I think there's plenty of sports that I can do as a man as well. Don't get fooled by her thumbnails. She's pretty deep, funny, and competent. <laughs> Sometimes this resonates with me as well. Um, minus the minus the deep and competent. <laughs> no. <laughs> like I wonder sometimes how you can portray your personality on one thumbnail, then. Uh, like on top of it integrating the the video that represents it uh, and then still make it funny that's a job Yeah, welcome to the Discord channel. <laughs> Shit. What's the new person that joined? I where's Lika? There is only one person that that's name is definitely not Lika. Are you sure you joined the right server? <laughs> <coughs> Uh, if you have any questions regarding my Discord channel, let me know. Because apparently I I failed to <laughs> explain um, thoroughly how to use my Discord channel.
Okay, if you look at the picture of my reference picture, do you think she looks up? Like, do you think her, um, her hat is more lowered or more, like, or is it like increased? Like, because it's such a weird angle and it, that changes the entire perspective of where I draw the horizontal line. Because if it would be lower, I need to like set it here. If it's like higher, it's like here. And I seem to struggle with this. Like personally, I would like put it here. Seems about right. Because to me, it feels like it's a little bit more tilted, tilted lower. Mm. Come on, why is no one, why does no one know how to use Discord? I don't know how to use it myself, but yeah. <laughs> oh wait, um, for those who haven't seen this magical thing that I can do at my stream while I go on a small pee break and um, getting some water break is I can make you look like you look in clouds and that's what I'm going to do because <laughs> I still have to change um, how to set up my stream but in the meantime enjoy looking in the clouds see you soon Hi, I'm back. Oh, her head is more upwards. Ah, oh, Jesus. You might be right. That explains a lot. That should make it work. It looks already bigger and better. Wow. Oh my God, you enabled me to become an artist. That was fast. Insert naughty comment because I'm a naughty boy. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> <sighs> <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Casually dies. <laughs> it's okay, we still have definitely not Lika in our troop. <laughs> it's a it's it's a good imposter. An imposter we can work with. We are not destined to die as a group. Wow, my, my, it looks so much better already. I can't believe it. Maybe you should become an artist, uh, a drawer, a painter. Wait, you told me once that you do. <laughs> Thank you. 
<lacht> Aha. Ja, okay. Hey, Bundy, what's up? <lacht> So, you should not, especially now that I started drawing, you should actually st start all over again with me. What are you waiting for? Nothing. Um, what's up with me? I'm drawing. Um, I have a busy life at the moment, but I filmed a video for Lombard, uh, like a Lombard video <laughs> that I will soon edit. What else is happening? I was in Rotterdam to skate. And now I chat with you yeah. okay we, we we reached we reached the the peak of my stream Lika started procreate freaking finally so does it mean you're my painting buddy now I'm still look at this face it's perfectly Symmetrical now. Or oh, is it? No, it's not perfectly symmetrical, but because of you, I made it work. You're a magician. You're a magician. Thanks. <laughs> I'm not actually sure if you can see it. See? Lovely. <clears throat> Lika, you have to show me some of your drawings. We won't pass through another step in our friendship if you wouldn't Send me one of your drawings. Unacceptable. <clears throat> well, what? So you just practiced. But that's magic to me. So share it with me. It's actually easy to start understanding what you see in a picture as soon as you start doing the poses yourself. <laughs> uh, so are you telling me I should just weirdly move my hat every time I draw now? <laughs> That's some weird kink, you got Lika. <laughs> no, it's a good idea. It's a good idea. I will implement this to my sessions. It's like we are wearing it as a badge, like 
successfully become a naughty boy and a naughty girl. Life's peak. So are you sending me your pictures? <laughs> am I am I just pushing you now? I'm not sure. believe it you sent me some pictures whoa that's cool wow that's amazing I am hearting it that's how amazing I think it is you have a flirty personality You're not the first one to say that. <laughs> oh wait, you're not the first one to say that. <laughs> okay, that's a... Wow. Wait, can I show you some pictures? Can I show you some pictures? Lika, do you allow me to show to the stream to sh um what amazing drawings you did <gasps> wow oh my god things are becoming better and better okay um transition moment the first picture that's what Lika does I feel like a grandma who doesn't know how to hold up a phone can you see that son child how to use a screen look at the details look at the peak of the mountain Look at the grass. No, actually amazing. <laughs> mm. These eyes. Wow. I am miles apart from this. I'm amazed. Totoro? <laughs> Lovely. And that almost looks like me screaming. Lika, why would you draw me? Yeah? Do you see the resemblance? No, I love it. Thanks for letting me share your art with the stream. <laughs> <laughs> uh. 
Uh, was this a sign? Yes, it was a sign. Let's have a drawing session together. Yes, please. You know, perhaps these streams aren't so uh, unproductive for you at all. And you could use this as a way of communicating with me and filling up my hours for the YouTube partner program. Because I am, ad after, I am an ad after all. <laughs> a less obnoxious one. <laughs> Do you enjoy drawing or when are you drawing? <laughs> the streams are lovely. It's you who make it lovely. You. <laughs> well, we we can we can have phone calls and video calls sometimes. Actually, all all the time. I like chatting with you. Yes, this was digital digi digitalized. <laughs> what? Why do I have a flirty personality? What am I doing? It's just me. <laughs> yeah, but for real, I wouldn't mind staying in contact more this time around. I feel like Korea has uh, subsided some of our, um, like some of that time we could have had, and now that Korea is over, and I can be the human being, a good friend again, I'd say let's continue. Nice. <laughs> wow. Actually, I am. I think this painting, like this sketch, is quite decent. Uh. Everyone is so talented on my stream. I am amazed. <clears throat> Wait, oh, fuck. Oh. My face is still showing red. Yeah, the sketch is ready. There you go. Can you see it? <laughs> uh, I think it's good. Question mark. It's 
slowly but surely I I do um do choose the right proportion sizes. Oh thank you. <laughs> Is this just another way of feeling validated? <laughs> I mean the streams. Yes. <laughs> no, I'm not a quick learner. I'm just I'm just obsessed. That's the difference. People sometimes think that I am good at things. I just I don't do anything else but obsessing over things. <laughs> like sometimes like the the funniest moments in my life is when I talk to someone who is emotionally um, and like intelligent enough and aware of themselves and how they navigate through life so much so that they can tackle my obsessiveness with <laughs> in dots um, Yuki life sometimes isn't all about productivity and um, working on yourself okay <laughs> dots so these are the nicest conversations because they are absolutely right. <laughs> I am just a maniac. But thank you. I'm grateful for your kind words. <laughs> Feel free, uh, <clears throat> feel free to set your pictures and whatever on the Discord channel. That's what it's there for, after all. <laughs> like, one day... I will share with you how I organize my life and at that very day you will think that I'm crazy because from the outside looking I'm just I'm just vibing but little don't you know that I am an obsess I have an obsessive personality Jesus, that's good. Can you see it? That's what I love about digital painting. You can see how much you can, with accuracy, draw, draw the lines that you intended to do. I could never do this traditionally, and I would never, um, I would never be able to judge whether I'm leaning towards the right direction. Such a good way to learn. Love it. It's just, just another ad for um, selling an iPad. Perhaps. I am a running, briefing, living ad. Who's not earning money from it at all. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> as long as we do it, it's fun. It's fun, it's fun. Okay, I got to save this. This is the picture I want to keep because I am happy about this. <clears throat> uh, did you have any drawing experience before you started drawing digitally? 
absolutely zero. <laughs> Not a single bit. I was once um, congratulated in school, but my entire class did not enjoy drawing and I was considered the odd one out. That's why I stopped. <laughs> but other than that, not really. I always felt like it was too difficult. <clears throat> Mm. Ooh, la la. <sighs> I also think I'm gonna stop live streaming soon. Oui. Oui, oui. Drawing is so difficult, I can't believe it. Like, when I was a kid, I learned to play the guitar and it felt like I just, I just naturally picked it up. And it that bored me. <laughs> and now I, I see the struggles of learning something like an art. But, well, uh, it's a, it's a, challenge I did to me because I said to me, age doesn't matter. Age doesn't matter. <laughs> um, other than that, yeah. <laughs> and because I feel like being a barista allows me to draw a lot. But yeah, go get your groceries. Thanks for Tapping in on my live stream, Liko. That means a lot to me. For real. I'm glad you have a good time. Uh, I mean, a great time. <laughs> All right. I'll let you go have your groceries. And if anyone is still here on the on the stream, it was nice having you. Um. So then I'd say we leave it for now. <laughs> uh, thanks. Enjoy your evening as well. Uh, I want to stream more often again now that I have more time. Um, I will, I will look into the poems. Thank you for sharing and have a good week. <laughs> See you soon. Bye-bye.